What's good, y'all? Chris from JaspiesCaseBreaks.com doing 2022 Topps Chrome Baseball Hobby 12 box case break number three PYT. Did a little team random before. I just wanted to show everybody. I didn't show it in the previous video, the filler for it. But these are the teams in the order that they were from 1 to 13. Jose Jr. with the Royals, Barry with the Orioles, Matthew with the Tigers, Emery with the Cardinals, Matthew with the Angels, Emery with the Cubs, Jose Jr. with the Yankees, Alan with the Astros, Chad with the Dodgers, John with the Padres, Adam with the Mets, Travis with the White Sox, and Adam with the Brewers. So the 13 teams that we gave away in that order here is our sheet as well. Let's get that all printed up. Right here. There's our case behind. Here are our players and our teams. Thank you once again, everyone, getting this break filled out. I know Jason's been Jason's been heating up on the uh, on the cases. Let's see if we can keep it going. Here is our hobby case. Let me get that scanned out for my inventory purposes. Let me get to rocking. Who says no? All right. Let's do it, y'all. Falcons with a heck of a drive here. So I'll do it like Jason was done. I'm do this in packs of four. Two-point conversion. This is a six-point game here in L.A. Falcons making some noise here in the fourth. Oh, this would be not... Man, I don't know. The Rams would need to make a, a big statement here. I don't know. Get you there. The Falcons blocked the punt. Wow. This one, this one I can improve actually. I got you. This one should be good. You should be able to just copy that into the YouTube.com link and show it. Mm, like that color, though. So, I know... 
CJ Abrams and Spencer Torkelson are redemptions in here. So, with, those are the big rookies. I know there are plenty of vets. But those are the uh, the big rookie redemptions. Is there anybody else I'm missing besides CJ Abrams and, uh, and Torque? I think it's just them. I could be wrong, obviously, but... Thanks to Rebel for posting that in the chat. That's what I thought. I know that he, uh, we've pulled a couple. I think it's the one that we've been, I don't want to say consistently pulling, but uh, we, we have his, his on card. We've pulled it a couple of times. I know Teddy has. I know Jason has. I think I actually shipped one off yesterday on the IG. So I think someone. I think Teddy must have pulled one Friday. Yeah, I need the I need the Kyler to have a, a game here for fantasy wise. Man, Jonathan Taylor not doing me any favors here week two. Blue railway. I think I've seen the one I've seen is uh, I think the torque is like a was a purple, like a purple. I think the, just the regular purple refractor auto. That's the redemption. So I do think it's interesting that like the regular base key that are in here, but not any other refractors, any other parallels. Oh, it's a fumble! No way! Oh no! Oh no, LA. The Falcons recover with 322 here in the fourth. They're down six. What is going on in Los Angeles? Cooper. Cooper Cup fumbled that, yeah? Wow. That was interesting. So we'll have something right there. Oh no, what is going on, man? I think the uh, the easier thing about the hobbies, at least two, from what I've experienced, the jumbos have the kind of sticking together. The hobbies, at least, are a little more separate. Makes it easier for personals or even this. For real, G. Well, that's crazy, man. I, I mean, I'm, I'm happy about the Bengals not being very good. The AFC North, all all tied up here at one, one and one. Man. Shouts out to any uh, Tua investors. You look mo like a monster in the second half. Fourth quarter, too, man. Trust me, I, I mean I've say, I've been saying it that there's not a team and a player that scares me more in the league, in the AFC North than the Ravens and Lamar. And man, <laughs> I don't know what else Lamar could have done. I don't know what else what, what Lamar Jackson could have done to win that game. He is God. That guy's good, huh? Wait for the 28-3 meme, the reverse. Hitting it from the back. Hitting it the other way here for sure. That's crazy. Ooh, Drake London. What the hurdle? Ooh. This gets kind of nice. Yeah, Joe Flacco, the savior. Thank you, Adam. I appreciate you, man. I don't know what I, I know I'm wearing the jersey. I do not want to talk about this game today, man. Holy crap. God, man. Holy hell. Thank you. Joe Flacco, man. Brees Hall had a pretty decent game, too. We like Brees Hall. We would like the youngster to be good. We like Brees. Defense making some plays, too. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's like, that's the dream, man. Hines. Hines field once. Oh, man, that'd be incredible. 
one day. My parents are going to be crazy because they're not really here. They're not in the West Coast at all. My parents were, as a Christmas gift to each other, we're going to fly out there to a game. I, I'm telling you, it's like, they're, they're still, obviously, like a lot of teams are, like, they're a couple years away. But the Jets have some really exciting pieces. Garrett Wilson, Breeze Hall, we'll see if Zach figures it out. That's good, there we go, man. And you're going at the perfect time, too. It's not going to be horribly cold. Like, today, it's like, what, 78 in Pittsburgh at Heinz? It'll be around that. It'll be a little colder, probably, as we head into the fall, but... I would assume that you're catching a, a, a fair weather game. Nothing too crazy. I mean, that was the one thing. So, like, that defense is obviously not as good as their offense is all say. But, man, Tyree, Tyree was doing whatever he wanted. Jalen Waddle. Ooh. Jalen Waddle and Tyree combined for, like, what? The five touchdowns? I think uh, someone else had the sixth. We like that. So this was box three. Here's box four. We'll get going on this. Before we hop to our He's a huge X fact. I know, like, with it's like a not like, crazy thing to say, like, hey, that guy's good. But man, that Dolphins team it looks like a way different team with him on the field. They gave Tua another monster weapon. Arguably a top five, definitely a top ten wide receiver in the league. And the crazy thing is, too, Kansas City was totally fine. The Chiefs look, oh boy, the Chiefs look good, too. Even without Tyree. Nice little Neil Cruz on the top of that. Back. Come on, Atlanta. Come on, Atlanta. start with this stack. Pack. I think one of the earlier packs I did only had a few cards in it, two or three cards. That would have like, put like five or six. I don't think it's one of the patches. But here we go, y'all. There's the first four boxes of our case. Good luck. That's nice, Wander Franco. It's picked. It's picked at the one. That's ball game. Wow. The Rams. Out of absolutely nowhere. First auto. Gabriel Arias. It's for the Cleveland Guardians. 
That's for Walter. I think Jason was just kind of going on these. We'll sleeve it up, obviously, but we'll get going. Second auto, but after that, Griffin Jacks. A little Aqua Refractor. 146 out of 199. Wander. Okay. Wow. So close. <laughs> So close. Head now? Yes, sir. All right, man. I will see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, man. Take it easy. That's our guy, Jesus. Let's get the rest of this box going. Classic Shohei. The classics are sweet. It's a cool little insert. There's an Onio Cruz. Yeah, that, see, that was those last two was the Bobby Dalbeck. Bobby Dalbeck had like felt a little thin on the pack. There's a couple cards, but that first pack got like six, so it evens out thankfully. Someone uh, proposed that Shohei, if if he really wants to be taken more seriously in the MVP race, he should not pitch for the rest of the season. He should just focus on hitting. I thought, you know what? That's actually not a terrible idea. Because all anyone's ever talking about is Judge's offense. Like, he's so good offensively. He's the best player and the best hitter in the league. Like, yeah, it's true. But Shohei's no slouch. But I think he's been a much better pitcher this year than he's been a hitter. Just because he's focused on it. But I think it'd be interesting if he's like, I'm just going to I'm gonna hit for the next month. But also, I think this is the thing too, Rebel. I think he could maybe win Cy Young. This is box two. Classic Toronto Devers. Aaron Judge, speaking of the devil. Oh, Aaron Judge, refractor. We really are lucky to watch this guy in his prime. That is just, this shouldn't make any sense, but here we are. I, I really think at this point it's just he's Aaron Judge is just so good offensively like he's having one of the best offensive years of this century by someone not named Barry Bonds I think it's just kind of hard to take that away he's just been so good even though Shohei really has been the best baseball player obviously being able to do both at such a premier level is so valuable, but I don't know, man. I think it's Judge. I really do think it's Aaron Judge. But like, oh, like they're not not like a lot of years. I don't think there's a wrong answer. It's not like you know either of them is stealing an MVP away from the other. Second auto, Holy Park. Rookie for the Pirates. Pittsburgh Pirates going to Michael Losia. And I think that is the problem, though, Gio. 
I think the voter, but the voter fatigue, while it is stupid, it does exist, unfortunately. I think he, like, again, if, if, if this was the first time he's doing it, it'd be unanimous, even with Aaron Judge having as great of a season as he is. But, you know, some voters say oh, he's done it before, and Judge should arguably have one already. Probably Alex Kirloff for the Twins. Once again, going to John. 159 out of 250. I don't know why I thought this was Shohei. One more time. I just think Judge is on a completely different planet offensively. Randy Cruz, Hyper. We'll, we'll hide our second auto, Joe Musgrove, who was having a really good season. He kind of fell off a little bit. It's hard, though. Padres, one of the teams that we were in our team random. That's going to John once again. Look at this. Is this? I don't think it is. It looks upside down. I thought it was going to be a short print. They check out the code on the on the bottom. Let's focus in. It says 67 on the bottom. And 67 on the bottom here. So just flipped upside down just to kind of troll us. Tell us short Rio. And of course, all the cards that are, all the refractors that aren't being sleeved, the shipping team will knock out. Same with these that are being sleeved and not top loaded. Like I think the main thing you can you can argue for for Vladdy last year was that you know he was doing it at such a young age that it was so impressive, but like. Shohei was a better pitcher than he was a better hitter than he was a pitcher last year, and it's kind of the other way around this year. But Judge is on a different level than Vladdy was last year, and Vladdy was really good. Another Wander Classics. And the Rams will hold on. Wow. Trout. Are you, I heard he messed up his leg, but damn. That's a shame, man. Our best wishes go out to the kid. We want a, a nice, healthy recovery. That stinks, though, man. Dang. All right, well, I guess it is a good thing they kept Jimmy G. Just in the camp of Otani making any team good more than Judge. Yeah, I oh, I am not a, a wins matter guy, especially with an MVP. Uh, and Shohei really is just like what he, what he what he can do for any major league team is just incredible. I just I think Judge has been so good. Spencer Watkins, first auto from this box. Baltimore Orioles. Let's go into Barry. Signature here. The last little P. I like the W. Queen out of my young man. Let's go to Barry. Let's go to Barry. Let's go to Barry. Let's go to Barry. Let's 
43 out of 350. Walker Bueller, Teal for my Dodgers. And again, another one of the team random teams that's going to Chad. One eighty four out of one ninety nine. Blue Ray Wave Auto, Ricky Auto, Miguel Sanchez for the Brewers. Oh, I should turn on a different game. My Ram speed done. Forty four out of one fifty on the Miguel Sanchez Brewers and Adam. Another team random. So both autos there. The last stack of box number three. Charlie India. That's the card that was flipped upside down for some reason. Do the double XP Call of Duty stat for him is so funny to me. Change the channel real quick. We're still on CBS, yeah? Yeah. Finishing up. I think it was Cowboys. All right. Gavin Sheets. T. Higgins. Come on, Dallas. Come on, Dallas. Going for the two pointer. Come on, Dallas. Dang. Cutter Crawford. Great name for a pitcher. Rookie for the Boston Red Sox. Oh, that's going to Burke. Well, then I can do a little counter argument. Guys that size who play the outfield aren't supposed to be as good defensively as he is. He's a great, great right fielder and a great center fielder. They put him in center this year, too. Zach Wheeler in the negative. Another one for the Phillies, another one for Zachary. Orange, Kyle Tucker, a little color match there. Houston Astros, Kyle Tucker, Allen. 20 out of 25. Very nice. There's low parallels coming in this with the negative coming and a red coming up too. Good luck. Behind our Mookie Betts. Wow. You know it's all about the boom. Bobby Witt Jr. Red Refractor Auto. Woo! -hoo. Five out of five. Man, oh man. Kansas City Royals. The top spot in our team random giveaway. And our number one on the free early bird spot. Jose Jr. with a monster. Jose, congrats, man. That's a beaut right there. Woo! See what that looks like, man. Yeah, please. Ooh, man, alive. Hachi Machi. Doesn't look like it's scratched up either. It looks perfect. No, it looks, it's beautiful. It's a, this is a work of art right here. Jose Jr., congrats, man. Ooh, let me put that right here for the whole world to see. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to call my shot, uh, but I, I was going to say, I feel like we should get a Jose. I we should get a J Rod auto. I don't want to call my shot. And I'm glad we didn't because we got that instead. Man. 
Wow. I told you. We were heating up. <laughs> Jason was ripping last couple days. We were there were something big was coming. Wow. Wow we All Jose's. Now I feel like it's one of those things where where I'll do like a I'll do personals on the IG obviously sometimes and uh it's like someone will grab a couple boxes of the same product and I'll just pick like whichever one I'm doing first. And a monster will come box one and I'm like, man, I wish we saved that for last. This that was gonna be box one in the case. That was the first one that I picked. That's just insane. Man. Come on down. I cannot believe I have to root for the Cowboys here. It's so annoying. Got a purple. I'll be riding that high all day. Don't mind me. Yeah, I, 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 we were just talking about that earlier. Is that we? I was convinced that only his base autos were were live, and I thought we were talking about that, that all the parallels on the refractors are going to be redemptions. But I guess not the Reds. Man. You know, I didn't I didn't want to say anything, man. I saw the hat and I know I know what his card art looks like. And I'm like, dude, I don't wanna say it. I just don't. I just you know I don't wanna, you know. But man, that's uh that's pretty good. They've been they've been decent, man. I mean, I know the Central's not too hot, and the the Guardians are kind of holding on when they really shouldn't even be in it. But it's good that the Royals are kind of doing their thing. They had some nice moments all years pitching wise. I think Brady Singer had some pretty good games. They're pretty good month, yeah. I think like it's July or August too. They're really good. MJ Melendez had some moments. He may be the catcher of the future for that team. They still got guys coming up like Nick Prado, their big first base prospect. And Bobby has definitely had some moments on that team, so it's always good to see the youngsters bopping. My, uh, my prediction was that it was going to be a lot of Tigers Royals for the next few years. At least one of those is looking right. They're they're an interesting little squad, and I like Asa Lacey a lot. I like Luke Emerson. Oh, is it is it Luke Emerson? Is it Luke Emerson or like Emerson Hancock? I could be thinking of the pitcher for the Mariners, but they've got some pitching prospects that are pretty good too. And I don't know how good the Central is going to be, either, either the AL or the NL. So they, they may mess around and win a couple divisions within the next few years. fans out there, but ugh. Ugh. Can both teams tie? Can both teams lose? 
I'm mostly joking. I know. There, you know what the funny thing was that the Steelers and Bengals almost tied as well at 20, which is the score of the Houston Indianapolis game. There were only there was, before week one, there's only been one 2020 tie. It happened a hundred years ago. So there would have been not just a second 2020 tie, but a third 2020 tie, and they would have ended at the exact same time. We got some goals. And the color, all the colors of the rainbow here, man. Let's get it going. Come on. Good case so far. Let's hope it's another nice one. I know. What is like the like the next like the most likely? And it's hard to get them. Like, what's the most likely score going that's going to happen this year? Like, what's not been hit? I would assume it's a game that involves zero, right? Like, some team really gets blown out like zero to 54. Something insane like that. It is weird. I don't know if it's a mixture of, of teams kind of being a little smarter with scores and, and plays or going all out or check downs and stuff like that, but I do think it's weird the ties. What? <laughs> Did I just throw a, ran a, a random score. And it's happened. Of course it's happened. I mean, football's been around for a long, long time. That's why, like, I always think it's impressive in something in sports that happens for the very first time. Like, one player does this insane thing that's never happened before. In any sport. Football, baseball, basketball, hockey, soccer. Soccer. Hockey and soccer. I think it's impressive when, when players and athletes find new ways to do something that's never been done before. Of course, 54 to nothing has happened. Of course it has. What am I saying? How foolish am I? <laughs> I'm looking, you know what I'm looking to get now? Now, now I'm, I'm not trying to say anything, but I think it'd be pretty cool if we got a patch auto here, right? It's, oh, it's the best. Like, I remember, like, there was a string of perfect games where I think there were, like, three in a span. It was, like, Felix Hernandez, obviously. One of the one of the guys who could definitely do it and his prime at any, at any given point. And then it was, like, Dallas Braden and Phil Pumper. A couple of those names don't really fit. And it was almost on uh, Armando Galarraga, too. I'm like, mm. Any given time, man. It's That's a fact, for sure. Another one of these. Let me see. Oh, well, I guess there's, there's four. But white, you know? Some of these packs were heavy. Crazy, yeah. It was uh, it was Papa John's. Papa John's was given a lot of pizza away last year. There was, I think, eight solo no hitters, and then I think a few more combined. So we're gonna have a ten no hitter season or something like that. Insane. It's not supposed to be that easy, <laughs> you know. You know, that's why I'm so surprised that. Companies and businesses are rocking with like strike out ten, and we'll give you a free whatever. Because if you strike out, if the Dodgers strike out ten people, you get a jumbo jack from Jack in the Box. And I feel like that happens all the time. Like strikeouts are such a, a, a an not easy option. That's unfair to say, but strikeouts are a, a much more accessible thing. All right, <laughs> well, that was a two card pack, but there's an auto. I don't want a Big Mac. I think a Big Mac's okay. It's not my go-to at the Golden Arches, Black Donald's. 
Now I'm a I'm a McChicken or a chicken nugget kind of guy myself. Here's box eight. I'm waiting for it to uh, process, Mark. I want to see it with the video that I think it is is being uploaded. I can't check until it's processed. And when videos are as long as they are because of case breaks, I can't check until 45 minutes to an hour. So after this video, I'll be able to give an actual check mark. Big Mac Sacks? I mean, I bought a, a Jumbo Mac. It was, it was the... There was a Junior Mac, a Big Mac, and the Grand Mac, yeah? There most likely is a video for the Topps Jumbo 3. I just have to go find it. it was, if it wasn't uploaded yesterday, I'll have to do it myself. Come on, Dallas. That's why, like, you know, Carl's Jr. is kind of my go-to fast food burger place. They have, like, actual decent-sized patties. But if I'm getting a burger from a place, I might as well get it, like, out of an actual burger joint, you know? pretty okay with the uh, the non-bias. I do think that would be hard. Being a play-by-play a, a -play or even a color commentator and being somewhat biased. Being completely biased. Not just somewhat biased, but being completely non-biased. Like, I would want to be I would want to be a homer for sure. Especially from like a fantasy. Like if I have someone on my uh, on a team that I'm calling have a great game or not have a great game but I guess that's why they are the pros and they're not the domino no that's what it was Papa John's would do something too, yeah? Oh, it was the Papa Slam. That's what it was. Every Grand Slam, you can get a free pizza. Let's just start with this stack and move right to left like we did last time. All right. Here we go. Josiah Gray, rookie auto for the Nationals, Matt Arnold. Carl will stand in the teal for the Yanks and Jose Jr. 19 out of 199. Another Gabriel Arias Auto, rookie auto for the Guardians and Walter. Judge last card in that stack. <laughs> Tender was very funny.
stars Ryan Mountcastle. It's been a pretty decent year. The Orioles are, I think, probably the surprise of the season, yeah? Orioles out of nowhere. I do like the Manning cast, just because everyone else is so boring. But I'm cool with the Manning cast. I think it's pretty fun. It's a fun little idea. And I think it could be better. I think a lot of things. A lot of things in our team could be better. But I like it. I think it's pretty cool. I think they're very dorky, but you know, it is the Mannings. I can't be too surprised that the Manning brothers are dorks. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean... I would say I think, like a lot of podcasts, I think it's cool to, like, listen to by yourself. But if I'm, like, with, you know, my friends or my family, like, I'm not throwing on the Manning cast. I want to I wanna do the discussion they're doing with my friends and family, people that I'm with. All right. Let's go box two in this stack. Ryan McMahon in the pink. Going to the Colorado Rockies. Going to Travis. 280 out of 399. It's good. Thank you, Dallas. I know. So lame. So sad, man. Such a, an absolute bummer. You would have, Tony Romo making it seem like the Cowboys just won the uh, the Super Bowl. Wander. Kyler, please. Okay, I have to start Trevor Lawrence next week, I think. All right, then. You know, it's a nice one here. Blue on the railway. That's Gavin Sheets for the White Sox. Other White Sox going to Travis. 70 out of 75. This one will go one on, too. What's up, Rex? Hello, Rex. Oh, brother. Lesser, lesser of two evils for me. I don't have to hear too much from Cowboys fans. I don't want to hear anything from Bengals people. First auto, Zach Pop from this box. Miami Marlins going to John. How's it going, Rex? There we go. Thank God. I just need something here from Kyler. Uh, the obvious refractor. Kyler. Yes! No, what do you mean? No one complete. Oh, my God. This guy sucks. I put my faith in Arizona sports. This is what happens. Blue. AJ Alexi. Boo Ranger Rookie Auto. Insane. Only only Zach Wilson believers. 79 out of 150 on the AJ Alexi Texas Rangers. That's gonna go to Burke. the Bears game. Are they not this are they like the oh, Sunday night game? Another Wanda. The 
the one and one Jets against the zero oh and two Bengals. Crazy. Eight to. Ugh, man. Imagine being on the East Coast. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Give me a rushing TD real quick. I wouldn't mind. I'll take the points whatever way I could. What is that? What is that? Please, Kyler. Please, my guy. I need something here. Good start. Oh, that's right. Quick. Alex Kirloff. Second year auto for the Twins. And John. John again. AK-47. Kyler, yes! Let's go! Man, I needed that. Man, I needed that. That's what our gold going up in the next stack. Silent. No crews. We got a redemption. I'll hide it right here with the Chris Bryant. Put this right up here. Look at the look at the big brain on Gila. Monster. All right, our gold hiding behind the Jade or front of Tanner Bogarts. Brandon Bell. First gold of the case. G-Men. Giants and Steven with the Brandon Belt Gold. Eight out of 51 off from the number match. Yeah, Joe not too happy, but look, the the Raiders can win for all I care after this. I just needed them to I need Kyler to score here. Would love a two point conversion. I don't know how doable that is. This box has been a little sticky to each other. And Judge Refractor. Exactly. They just cover. That's all. And give me some points. We'll make a cover. That's it. That's all. That's all I'm asking for. Jacob Degrom. And the negative, nice. Jacob Degrom negative going to the Mets, going to Adam with with an early bird spot that he won. Very nice. All right. I think I've done this stack. Yes, I have done this stack. Trip. It's here. I think I've done this stack too. I think I'm getting lost. Yes. Wow. Wow. That's unbelievable. All right. Redemption here. Hiding behind the Chris Bryant. Good luck, everyone. Rookie autograph gold wave. Very nice. I'll be out of 50. Of... Brandon Marsh for the Angels. Nice. Gold Wave. An out of 50 Brandon Marsh auto redemption going to the Angels going to Matthew S. Which is, again, an early bird spot. And one of the teams given away. So Brandon Marsh, Angels edition. Gold rookie auto. I'm Chrome. Nice. 
I could not believe Kyler hit that. That's crazy. What a catch, too. What a crazy play to tie this game going to OT. That's insane. Woo. Oakland A's legend right there, man. So here, Chrome Refractor. Nelly Cruz out of 350. Pink Speckle. It's for the Rays. Rays edition of Nelson Cruz. Going to Jason. Yeah, not ideal. The day after his birthday, too. Probably just wanted a, a Raiders win. John Heasley, rookie auto for the Royals. Another one going to the Royals. Another one going to Jose Jr. Anthony Bender on the Refractor Rookie Auto. He had a four ninety nine. dollars Miami Marlins going to John. Three fifty six dollars out of four ninety nine on the Anthony Bender Refractor Rookie Auto. Purple John Lester. Cardinals and Emery one eighty out of two fifty. All right, that was boxes five to eight. So those last four in the back, and that all we'll call it a wrap on this case with a, a monster from our very first box peeking right there.
OT. Hopefully, car with a dot. Start it off. Oh. Well, just for the rest of the ripping, I'm gonna sit down. The back is not doing me no. Oh, Rex. Oh, Rex. Just this. Just a five out of five, Bobby Wood Jr. rookie auto. Oh man. Just the baseball hit of my life, of my career. Crazy. Full, full pack there, Jesus Louise. Uh, I think if we, I mean, you sell it now as soon as a ASAP, I would say at least five figures. A beauty, though. I only wish it was three, three or five. That was a nice welcome back. First break, first box. Teddy had to take a look. <laughs> Definitely. And Teddy was saying that he said that some of the uh, he uh, got another red too. Wow. All right. Teddy said that he's seen a, 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 some autos that have been like scratched up just because of the chrome stuff. Yeah, team filler. Early, early bird, so early bird spot combined with the team random giveaway. A free, a, literally a free. A, 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 a free card, a free, a free Bobby Wood Jr. out of five rookie auto. Crazy, 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 crazy. The Jets winning is forever, you know? The Jets beating the Bengals, that's forever. <laughs> I, it's it's karma, karma and, and luck and all that. It's it's a thing, man. It resets, you know? You, you put in, you get in what you put out. It's true, man. It is true. Especially in the hobby. I really honestly think that. Yes, I'm. I'm hoping it's the one that I think it is. I'm gonna. It's processing now, and I'll, it'll hopefully be up soon. 
I'm just, I want to, I need to make sure that's what it was. I know, man, what the heck? I'm trying to watch 60 Minutes. This, the pre-show for 60 Minutes is going long. Big stop here. Take it step by step. You've been scared of life, but it did you. There was one. <coughs> that one I definitely almost cut my fucking hand. That would have been funny. Definitely almost just took a chunk out of myself. Fourth and one for Kyler. And he fought. No way! He doesn't have... Con he doesn't have possession on the catch. Wow. Joe jumping up and down. Raiders defense. Making themselves known. Wow. It's a Hollywood Brown. Hollywood is burning now. Crazy. What a what a stop right there. Oh my god, Derek Carr hasn't played in like an hour. That's crazy. Forty minutes. Alright, and last stack of this case. So, and we'll do the rest of this box obviously. The rest of this case, and then we will get Jumbo PYT number three uploaded. And then I'll go check orders. Go roll through some warrants. Thought I found it originally. Like I thought I knew which one I needed to make sure. It wasn't processing in time before this break started. So first thing I do after I get Everything situated. We will upload last night's Tops Chrome Jumbo PYT number three. All right. 
Everyone, thanks again for getting involved. Thanks again for patience. So it's going to be a long break with the cases of hobby, but here we go. Last four boxes. Thanks again. Good luck, everyone. Some more golds behind the Cedric Mullins. Shamanaya, A's edition. Let's kill off then Shamanaya. 32 out of 50, Oakland A is going to Ben. Oliver Ortega, rookie auto for the Angels. Going to Matthew. And then there's John Heasley. John Heasley. So quick on the autos this time. John Heasley. Another John Heasley going to the Royals and Jose Jr. Oh no! What is going on this game, man? What is happening in Las Vegas? Now we're getting to the sticky. He's a psycho, man. He really is. There was a gold, and now there is a blue Brandon Belt for the Giants. Usually, the Astros are kind of loaded in this, right? A little Chase McCormick, Jose, 6 one out of 75 on the Brandon Belt. Let's see if we can get something here. That's game. That's pick six. That's game. Wow. Luis Frias, D-backs, rookie auto, going to Nico. That's like my third interview. Is that like, it's what did, he, what did he say? Like, I own you or I'm your daddy or whatever he said after their last game in Chicago. What a baller, man. Boy, that is tough. There's a Chase McCormick Hyper. Are we, uh... I don't, I don't really know if, if we could, uh... I don't really think we understand what that guy... What, what's going through that guy's head, right? I don't really think we any of us are on the same wavelength as Aaron Rodgers. Jackson Reitz on the Purple Speckle Rookie Auto. Sorry, 
Jackson Reed's Milwaukee Brewers rookie auto, Adam K on the purple speckle. It's 158 out of 299. That's a tough one though for for Joe. Happy birthday. Happy birthday indeed. Martin City. Ain't no love in the heart of the city. Andrew McCutcheon, pink speckle. Parallel, another fill. <laughs> Why do you do that? Why? Are we? How are are we? Are we certain that coaches know what they're doing? I feel like the play calling for a lot of teams these last two weeks has been like really suspect. I don't know. I feel like some guys just flat out don't know what they're doing on the field right now. Just because the coaching has been so bad. Oh, no way, right? Wait. Wait a minute. No. Okay, he's in. He's in. Ooh, that looked pretty close, though, huh? Wow, how crazy would that have been? Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, we got a red coming up here. Behind the call, Lewis. Ivan Castillo. Nice. Rookie auto for the Padres. Padres. John. Another one that's five out of five on the rookie auto. Ivan Castillo. Nice. All aboard the, uh, you can I can't do that. That was close, right? Like, whoa. Can you imagine? Max Free, Pink Speckle, out of 350 for the Braves and Matthew S. Crazy. Griffin Jacks. Other Griffin Jacks. Twins auto going to John G once again. to give Jordan Alvarez a future stars card. It's like year three, right? And he's been a star. I just think that's funny as well. Speaking of future stars, Jazz Chisholm Green. 74 out of 99 on the Jazz Chisholm future stars. Another one for Miami and another one for John. To go with a teal way wave of Charlie Blackman. Rockies, 187 out of 199. That's going to Travis. Close one, huh? We've had some red, we've had some gold, we've got some orange. Can we? Can we be greedy? Can we ask for maybe a super? Water Franco. And then there was one. One box left. And then we'll put a wrap on Hobby PYT number three. Once again, we got Hobby PYT, I believe it's four down to eight. And then Jumbo's Rock on the site right now, jazbees.com. Let's finish this off strong. Thanks again, y'all.
shot refractor. stack. Patrick Mozeka, rookie catcher for the Mets. That's going to Adam K. Clayton Kershaw, the GOAT, Teal Ray Wave, going to the Dodgers, going to Chad. 197 out of 199. Cruz. Our last auto, nice one for the Brewers, Freddie Peralta, Teal Ray Wave Auto. Milwaukee Brewers, Adam K. Seventy-eight out of one ninety-nine on the Freddie Peralta teal railway auto. That's our last auto. Let's see if we can get one more nice parallel or a nice rookie refractor. Last card: Randy Rosarina Hyper and a Harrison Bader. All right. Thanks again, y'all. Appreciate you sticking with me. That puts a wrap on Hobby Case Break number three PYT. Let's go through our autos. This is Hobby 3. Yes, Hobby 3 in the books, in the pocket, and out of sight. Let's go through a little recap of our autos. And some of the notes, lower pair notes, Parallel Shamanai, Gold. Brennan Marsh, Gold Wave, Rookie Refractor. Jacob DeGrom, negative. And a nice one in there. And then we'll get to the, uh, the big one at the very, very end. But man, oh man, right here, one more time. Congrats to Jose Jr. Bobby Witt Jr. Red, five out of five on the Chrome Rookie Auto. Man, oh man. All right, thanks again. Let's get this uploaded. Or after this, I will upload Jumbo Case PYT number three from last night. Thanks again, y'all. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.